everyone so this is a different video today I am NOT going to make a podcast this month because I don't have enough things to show you guys and yeah I don't want to overexerse myself so I'm going to give you a yarn haul today if you don't know me and it's the first time you see me I am Ashley and here and in other social medias you may find me as Ash Love Makes and I have all the links to those I'm missing one but I will put that sooner than later in my description box below so yes um, I am a little wall energy today but it's because the weather is, is ugly and I'm cold but let's let's get to this um, so the first purchase I did was purchase a, purchased from Tuesday morning. <clears throat> I got four balls of fingering weight yarn. Um, they are 100 gram skeins. And they are similar texture as Bernat, um, Bernat sock. Yeah, that, that's what it is. Or Penton. I don't know one of those is the same the same brand different name <laughs> uh so yeah i got this one right here and i just searched for this i put out of focus on this thing let's see if it works there we go i put um i searched for wisdom yarn pros or pros um online and the skeins are actually it says 1899 but you can find them for eight dollars and 99 cents online um i paid 4.99 for each of these balls this one is called men's wear and as you can see here it has all these blues and all that prettiness so pretty I do not like to use autofocus on my camera because it's kind of weird. But yeah, it is 100 grams. It is 75% superwash wool and nylon. So it's enough for two socks. And these are the other color I got is Foxy. I think it's very pretty. See if my camera wants to focus. Is it? Let me see it. There. took off my hand my head so you can see it uh, there you go it didn't focus but you can get the gist of the colors <laughs> and this is this one right here that one focused so it's a blue and it has kind of like this white colors very pretty And then there's this one right here. I find this one so pretty. The colors are not coming out as true. This green right here is very, there's a green, and this green right here is very lime green, and the blue is softer. All these colors are much softer in tone, except the fuchsia and the dark blue that might look purple on, is it purple? It is purple, but it looks blue on the camera. That's why I meant to say. I think it's pretty cute. When will I be making socks? Who knows? Because <laughs> I need to finish some. But I know I will not be buying more sock yarn. And this is good, sturdy. Like, it's. Uh, I didn't tell you if it was scratchy or not, but it's not scratchy. But I. It's. How can I tell you? Say this. Um, not scratchy it's a strong horse working horse yarn and it's it's just like that sock yarn that we get for but instead of getting one skein that is 50 grams I got a hundred grams for five dollars for the price of that at Tuesday morning and it was worth it like I think the, the thickness that it has is the thickness I like for my sock yarn and it looks like it's not going to be splitty or any of that. So, yeah. I bought one. And then I went back and bought three more. 
Um, and now the big haul is from Hobby Lobby. I do not support any of their things, rules, traditions, um, stereotypes, religion. What else can I say? I don't know. You know, I usually don't go there, and if I do, I don't buy a lot of yarn because they don't have a lot of sales, anywho. So, when I saw the clearance, and it was good money, sorry, there's like dog hair everywhere, um, I decided that I was going to go and buy some yarn. Let's let's get to this. So, I got three of these. They're the same yarn. And then I saw on Instagram that somebody designed a sweater with this yarn. And there was a bunch more that I could have gotten to actually make myself that sweater. But, oh well. I'm not going over there again. It's like a 35 minute drive and I'm not, I really don't like driving through that road that Hobby Lobby is at. It's very, very busy. So this one, it is um, 251 yards or 330 meters and it's a light um, VK yarn. You might hear my daughter singing. Um, it is 449. It was 449. Um, and it is polyester. And I paid a dollar twelve for it. For each of these balls. They're the same. This is the color mushroom. This one. Um, the gray one is gray and uh, the black is black right yes the black is black the only difference in color was the cream one that was called mushroom and they are from yarn bee from hobby lobby i'm putting them over here so the next one i have are these three they're super soft these three I plan on making some amigurumis with these ones. Oh, so pretty. Look at these colors. So beautiful. Um, this one right here, this one, if you can see my thumb here, it's a mint green. And the other one's kind of like a light aqua blue. Because in the camera, you might not see the difference. Um, these ones were a regular price for $5.99. Um, I paid $1.49 for them. They are 259 yards, um, 237 meters. They are 62% poly made and 38% acrylic. This color right here is called mint, which I told you it was, it's a, it was mint. It's not looking as the, it's more green than blue than what the camera's showing. Put it over here. Um, this one is aqua. See, I told you it was like an aqua color. I cannot read the names. So just tell me. They, they all have the same yardage. Um, they're all the same components. It's the same yarn. Different colors. This is soft lilac. Very pretty. Then I got these two. They are the same same yarn I don't know if they're the same dye lot because I'm a poop head and I don't need dye lots um, uh, <laughs> they are the same dye lot I tried to make sure that I got the same dye lots if I got two of the same yarns um, this color is beneath the big top most of the yarn is gonna be yarn bee the other one I think was yarn bee baby um, it is 63 yards, 58 meters. That's why I got two of them, and it's 100% acrylic. Um, I paid, regular price was $4.99. I paid $1.24 for each of these. I got two because they have small yardage, and I was not sure if one, just only one, I think was not enough for a project, so I got two of the same. 
I got these ones. These are I love this I love these yarn super soft sport white. These are I love this yarn sport white. The color is not showing anything at all as it's supposed to be. It's more like a peach color. Um like a coral. It's like a coral color. Yeah, and that's the name, it's coral. But I actually got two different dye lots without even noticing. So one of them is more orange and this one is lighter in color. My husband said nobody would notice, but I noticed it once I got it home. Um, uh, yeah, I have a bunch of this color, which I use for a project that I'm going to show you on my next, next podcast next month. Um, but yeah. Um, let me tell you the yardages. The yardages are 230 yards, meters are 210 meters, um, and I it was regular price $2.29, and I paid $0.57 cents for each of these, so it was a deal. I had to grab them, even though I did not need the color. <laughs> I can make more foxes, right? There's never enough foxes in the world. Um, this one was the only one I got for regular price. They used their 40% off coupon because I needed it in my life. I have seen some posts on Instagram with this beautiful yarn and I was like, oh my God, that would make such a beautiful unicorn. So unicorn with this colors oh so pretty and Hong Kong has been bringing a lot of like handmade handmade hand dyed yarn I don't know if anybody else has noticed but I didn't notice when I went to buy this yarn that they have more of this hand hand look yarn hand spun kind of looking yarn like these two for example see there you go you see they look like they have been hand spun um, so these are 100% acrylic they are 252 well the blue one the blue, green and blue is 252 yards and to 330 meters the purple one has less yardage it's a 196 yards um, and 180 meters. They're both 100% acrylic. They're worsted weight. Regular price, they're both $4.99 and I got them both for each of them for $1.24 each. Yes, $1.24 each. That's what I got. And, oh, I didn't tell you the colors. Um, the purple one is called Blue Multi. And the green one, which I wasn't really a fan, but I might make a dinosaur or something out of this, so it's okay. Um, it's called, what is it called? Custard pie. I've never seen a custard pie that, that color. If you see one that color, run away. <laughs> um, then I got this one right here. Oh, this one's so beautiful. I love, 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 love. Let's read it because my camera doesn't want to focus right now. It is um, 252 yards, 330 meters, and it's 100% acrylic. It's a worsted weight, and the co color is Flor Florabelle. Yeah, that's the color, Florabelle. There you go. Regular price was $4.99. I paid $8.24 for this. So good good price happy about that then I got this one it's a cake yarn because I need more cake yarns in my life no I do not I have <laughs> enough of them um, this is yarn be delish boutique 
Uh, regular price was $6.99. I paid $1.74 for it. And this is the color Tarte to Tango. Uh, the, it has 500, 500, yeah, 590 yards and 540 meters. I think I'm saying it right, but, uh, I have problems with my numbers, but you can see it. And it's 90% acrylic and 10% alpaca. It is a DK weight yarn. And you can see all the specifications because sometimes I'm not good with numbers in English. Sorry. <laughs> but I got it because it had alpaca in it and I love alpaca. Um, I wish I could have one in my life. But I, I can't have animals in my yard. I have three dogs and that's enough. And one of them is not supposed to be in this house according to the rules of the neighborhood. So, yeah. <laughs> I got Yarn Be Sweet Divinity Red Clay. That's the color, red clay. Um, I think it's a DK white yarn. No, it's actually a worsted. It says it's a worsted white yarn. It has a hundred... No, it has um, 243 yards um, and 222 meters. And it says it's the worsted, but it's a pretty, pretty thin. It's kind of like a DK. So this is the color it's all about. It's, it's coming out pretty true color on the camera. So yeah. I got this rusty, it's kind of like a rusty color as you can see, it's really pretty. So I got it, oh, regular price was $4.99, I got it, I got it for $1.24, much better. No. Um, I'm going to show you the variegated ones because I believe they have the same yardage and weight and everything and blah blah blah. Um, yes, um, they are all... 102 yards and 93 meters. They're 80% acrylic, 20% alpaca, and they are a bulky weight yarn. They are beautiful. I don't know if you can see them, but they are beautiful. Look at that one. <gasps> so beautiful. Um, they are from Yard Biggie, and they are Andy's alpaca September sunset um, they are five dollars and forty nine cents and I paid a dollar thirty seven for each of these balls of yarn so yeah and these ones are the same yarns but they are solid color and they have more yardage because they're solid um so they are the same blends 80 percent acrylic 20 percent alpaca they have a 120 yards and 110 meters if you can see them here they were 5.49 and i paid a dollar 37 for each of these I love this camel green. I just, I love her that color. And last ones I have are these ones right here. They're all the same. They are Baby B, Sweet Delight. This one is tangerine, this one here. This one is wild strawberry, and this one is baby red. But it's not red, it's kind of like a pink as well. So this one's kind of fuchsia, and this one is a, a more soft, um, call it like a pink. I used to have a color, I used to have a color that looked just like this kind of like a, a neon pink kind 
kind of a light, me um, a light, a softer neon pink. Sorry, now my cell phone. Uh, my daughter's not enough, I guess. Uh, yeah. So the these ones are a hundred and no, sorry, three hundred and seventy-seven yards, um, three hundred forty-five meters, and they are a DK weight. They are regular price five twenty-nine, and I paid a dollar thirty-two for each of these. So it is a deal, like super mega deal, amazing. Um, so I got all the yarn, which I don't know if it's gonna fit there. I will have to do something about that. I already organized that, and then I went and bought some more yarn. <sighs> I am thinking of making really big, big amigurumis, like really chunky, holding like three strands of yarn to move some of this yarn <laughs> out of my stash because it's too much. Like I already organized my wool blends, and now I have more wool blends. And I don't know where I'm gonna fit them. I emptied out my rack over here where the flag is. I had a little um, thing up there on top of my books so I could stash some more yarn there and I moved it over here. It all fits now in this one. I moved all my uh, fancy sock yarn over here. There's some that isn't that fancy but I put it over here like my I don't have cashmere but um, merino wool and stuff and then I put some of the other um, sock yarn over here the ones that are in balls these ones are in hanks and then I have 100% wools here I took some of the yarns and I put them in hanks to make a little bit more space um, my Karen cakes I took off the pom-poms my cupcakes I took off the pom-poms out of those so they could fit better in there and I have another cake to stash in there oh my lord <laughs> how am I gonna fit more yarn in there I don't know really but this is all I have to show um, this month uh, wait for a review that I might be doing next week about some hooks that I got from Aliexpress uh, total that I spent was a $30 and some cents I lost my receipt probably took a picture of it and threw it away um, And um, taking in count, I took all the yarn uh, label prices, the regular prices, and it is a total of $121.26, not including the tax. So I saved a lot of money, guys. Um, I mean, I'll tell you right now because I'm really bad at math. <laughs> Intermission by Ashley. So 121 point. I imagine you're like screaming, it's this much. It's this much. Uh, I save $91.26 with some change, more or less, because it's not including tax. But that's how much money I save, which it was an amazing deal. I, I think I did not count, I didn't put the price for the 40% off yarn, so I might have spent, uh, I might have, well, no, I, I counted all of them, so I, I spent $30, that's what I did, uh, don't listen to me, I'm, I'm just rambling, so yeah, um, I hope you guys have an amazing weekend, and I hope to see you next week with my um, hook review I will try to knit something for you guys because I know I have knitters here as well and I have been in a crochet mood <laughs> but anyways guys I hope to see you next time and as always remember to do what you love <laughs> bye